This is a uh, Grob RW-A bandsaw blade welder. I haven't seen any videos for this, so I thought I'd make one real quick on how to use it. This is your heat selector switch. You got high, medium, low, and off. This is your weld button or your annealing button. These are where you clamp the blades. This lever here you only turn in a clockwise direction. And to start off before you weld, you set it to the blade width. This does up to one inch. But the bottom section is a sixteenth to three quarters. So I put it on that line. And that closes the jaws closes the gap on the jaws. Let me show let me turn this dial all the way around and let you watch the jaws. Turn it around, the blades would be in there now which would keep the clamps from moving. And then I would turn the jaws to the blade width where it says to weld, which would be half inch for my particular blade. As you see the jaws are all the way closed now but they're actually spring loaded and you turn this knob around to the annealing position first you have to open one clamp on the blade and open the other clamp I'll show you here directly turn it to the annealing position and the jaws are at their widest point this switch here will be on low and you tap this button until it turns red hot and then you tap it slower until it turns black okay Let's do a blade. Yeah, I believe it'll do. First, we have to set this dial to the right blade width, which is sixteenth to three quarters. hard to film with one hand but we're getting there sorry about that terrible terrible footage okay make sure your blades are cut good and square better than that bet it up good Okay, you can find that instruction anywhere. But now you turn the dial to your blade thickness. Which was a little bit too much pressure for my blade. They tended to overlap and cause a lap joint instead of a butt joint, butt weld. So I put mine on just past the 3 8 blade. That seems to be about right. Move your selector switch to high. And then you hit the button, once it realizes that it has completed the weld and the contact, it will automatically shut off. Close your eyes. Alrighty. See there, that welded that. There we go. That's welded. Welded good. Did it get it? Okay. Nope. Open the bottom jaws. Turn my selector switch. About where I know it's about halfway. The idea is to get your weld halfway in between the jaws when they're fully opened. That's okay. fully opened. And the selector switch to low, and then you anneal the blade.
it gets a good cherry red and then you let it cool off slowly turn it off open your jaws and remove your blade you can uh, bend your blade at more than a 90 degree angle you've done a good job next you can grind it off the weld make it shiny stick it back in there like you're going to anneal it only stop as soon as it turns blue and then it is tempered have a good day